Leave this to me. I don't think so. Get him! Need a light. <laughs> Let's do this. Enough. <laughs> wrong nothing is tifa like your girlfriend no hmm, but she's someone special it's not like that more like i don't know how to explain i see Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Damn similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come to think. <laughs> the reunion. Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. Hmm? <laughs> Alas, poor prince. My I dad told me that that man, he used to be a soldier. When he was younger. Hey, Cloud. I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry. I give you permission. I always have the latest information. 
Come find me if you want to know. I'll make sure to tell everyone around that you're here to help out. That way, you might get more work. Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. Sure hope not. I'll handle it. You will? Oh man, you're the best! I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Be careful, they look dangerous. Protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Let's go. Let us through, or else. Go on! 
Punch through. Right. We gotta hurry. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Buzz off. Let's go.
So, do you think this means another war is coming? The 65 slums are right. Hey, hey! Who said I was with you? My lights have been on the floor. Oh, I made a first roll of tires. And I... First place in the race. You eat to get a snack. Gramps has been feeling a lot better. Hmm? I heard, I heard, I heard you got them all, right? Robots from the reactor getting lost in the slums. Must be because of the explosion up top, huh? They must have thought they were protecting the reactor and figured I was trespassing on their turf or something. Maybe. Almost feel sorry for them. Getting all lost and confused like that. Oh, what am I saying? Man or machine? Shinra bitches get what they deserve. Now hold on. Anyway, I think it's safe to say our work here is finished. If you're ever in the market for a merc again, remember, you can count on Cloud. Uh, sure. And sorry about putting this on you all of a sudden. I'm really glad you were willing to help out, though. Thanks again. Actually, while you're here, I've got another favor to ask. There's this old guy who hangs out in front of the weapons shop. I think he might need your help. Would you mind talking to him? I see you're working hard, Mr. Merck. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. Oh, I know you. You must be that mercenary. I have a problem. It's the anniversary of my wife's death and I wanted to visit her grave. But I can't because some creatures have turned the graveyard into their nest. Could you do me a favor and go there in my stead? She shouldn't be alone today. It'll cost you. That's fine, that's fine. The graveyard's right by the head of the river. But I heard they put a new gate in recently to replace the old broken one. Now that those creatures have moved in, I'm sure it's locked up tight. The key to the graveyard, huh? I know, why don't we ask Oats about it? graveyard gate, are you? Well, it's your lucky day. Our local hero swiped it from some public security jerks. She gave it to Margie, so I'm guessing he's selling it for medals now. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. 
Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopa. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, are you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopa. Anyway, you've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But they'll need to buy a membership first. If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Well, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. Hey, you don't happen to have a key to a graveyard, do you? Of course! The Emporium has everything, Koopa. Until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile from ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopa. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys.
going in. Sorry, but we're in a rush. Too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered.
So, do you think this means another one? Hey, hey! You said you My life's a I made a pleasure all You heard what they said. Oh. According to officials who are involved with the ongoing investigation, I'm really grateful for what you did. Here's your reward. I owe him a lot. Maybe more than I can ever repay. And now, I owe you a lot, too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We paid our respects to your wife, and we took care of those creatures. Oh, that's such a relief to hear. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. But I was prepared to die trying. And then you two came along. Still, I've got to face facts. Creatures or no, I can't keep making these trips. Don't say that. This is the graveyard key. Run it back to Moggy. But I just told you about my legs. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <sighs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. <sighs> it's downright depressing. What is the world coming to these days? It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. You having fun yet? Heaps. Then you can't be afraid to show it more. Don't forget, it's all about service and salesmanship. I'll leave that to you. All right, but don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good, because I command a very good salary. According to officials who are involved with the ongoing investigation, You're that former soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? <sighs> that would be wonderful! There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. You're back! A ton of books. Come, look what we've done with the flowers! Lovely, don't you think? Great job! That's wonderful! <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot! I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. something else you should be worrying about right now? I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! Oh! Cloud? Hey there! How goes the patrol? 
There's a lot more people on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But, don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! Did you know? This place is haunted. It's haunted? I just love it. Aerith, drop by anytime. Tell me you're a and giving people directions. Plus, I helped an old lady cross the street. You've been busy. It's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh, no! I'm late! Did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! I heard there's someone going around helping people who need it. Soldier guys are awesome. I want to be strong and tough when I grow up, too. You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are going to have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh, man, I completely forgot. I have to get back right now. Gotta be that work. Keep it up, buddy. Sure, hope not. <sighs> I'm glad I moved here, but nice sword you got. Just one night in Walmart. 
Hmm? That sure was something. Seeing the reactor light up like that. Wall markets making bang. All clear down this way. for monsters. The reactor just went up in flames. Eh? I was born and raised topside. Nothing is these lungs. Hmm? Is it weird that I prefer this part of town? Avalanche must have used some heavy duty. No telling what we get these occasional monsters. But seeing as I maybe I'll go to check to see if it's still on. How is it that you guys caught Avalanche? Interested in joining the watch? The train guy got so much as butt. This place takes getting used to. Mm -hmm. One of my friends told me that this hot mercy. So, do you think this means another one? Did, did I just see sure. that? Sure. Got any spare machine? Well, I just Pack more gum or two. Wonder if I get in trouble. Oh, it'd be great if they asked us again. I don't think I know you. You don't look familiar. That's what's called these. I don't doubt you The spice of us will be better catch up soon. We're looking at another <gasps> day in Midgar. You scared me. Hey there. How goes the patrol? I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Uh, but that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. They won't talk to avalanche guys. do I own it? bunch of his favorites, and I'm gonna read them all. If I want to become a successful shopkeeper, I have to study super hard. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. <sighs> you guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's got to be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money! The Watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, They'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us. Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. <sighs> I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. The Toad really King wants like to take over our hideout. And she's He's really mean nice. and angry. Smells bad too, so be careful. <laughs> Sounds like you've made a real neighbor. A spokesman. Uh, 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 eh? I heard there's someone going around helping people who need it.
Okay then. <laughs> Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Here it comes! One more shot! Enough. Get him! Was never in doubt. Piece of cake. That it? Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back.
buzz off. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the King and his smelly friends. Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. Hmm. Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. A real family, in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. No idea. Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. 